I'm going to go ahead and explain what this is in the beginning and then we'll just jump right into it. This is a new series. This uh, series of videos is it's going to be like I will shoot clips on the camera and instead of me talking to the camera like this while I'm in town well because I'm doing this because I don't want to be able to I don't want to have to attract attention when I'm in town and I see funny things or I see really hilarious kind of things and when I leave Salt Lake City and I'm back east or whatever wherever I could be on vacation anywhere and I can do one of these just like secretly record what's going on like I did today in a few scenes and then I'll just go ahead and uh, um, commentate in between in scenes like this. So I'll, put, I'll post the clips on the, in the video and then in between I will shoot instances like this where I commentate. So this is what's going to happen. I'll have this on my computer. Let's find it. I'll go ahead and I will watch it. And after the clip is done I will stop it. I will record a little commentary by myself and then you can go ahead and see why I recorded the clip, what's going on, and why I thought it was funny. And so, I haven't thought of a title yet for this series, but it's new. I'll post it on the video blog on my channel, and please watch it. I hope you enjoy it. So, let's, let's get started. So the clip that you just saw was me on the bus, and you can't really see him too well, but the bus driver looks exactly like Santa Claus. No joke, St. Nicholas, right there on the bus. He was driving. I got on the bus, and I've been with him a few different times when he's driven this route. So I get on the bus ten blocks down outside of downtown, and he drives straight through downtown. And so I get on his bus, and I looked at him today, and I was like, oh, I've got to record this. And he was actually, I credit him for the birth of this series, because it's just really funny how this all played out. But I can't, you had to really be there, and so that's what's unfortunate. I wanted you to feel like you were there, you just couldn't get a good view. He has a big white beard, and he had sunglasses on, so it was like a cool bus driver Santa, right out of like a comedy show or something. But it was funny, and I thought I would share that with you. Okay, so what you just saw there, I, it was me shooting around the buildings. I was acting like I was showing you the skyline, but that wasn't what I was trying to show you at all. I was right downtown waiting for my bus to get back home. This was at the end of the day, kind of. And there's a woman with a blue-green shirt and a guy with a white shirt. And they're, they're sitting next to the guy with the newspaper. If you need to, rewind it. Watch it again. It's very short but I didn't want them to know that I was recording them. It's the woman and the man. They are very, very, very weird. This woman, and I, I don't make fun of people. I don't do that because I don't like people to make fun of me. But this woman is very large. She's very obese. And this guy, he's not really overweight or anything. But it's so weird because they come over and she's just kind of whining at him like, I don't want to do this and I want to do that. She's very demanding of him. They're in a relationship because she's holding his hand. But I think that she needs to wear another pair of pants because her... Uh, I don't, I don't really want to say it because it's disgusting, but she has this big bulge in her pants like because of her weight down there. And there's nothing hiding it. And so I was just like, whoa. And so there's people on the bench and there's only room for her or him, one person. And so she sits down and she tells him to sit on her lap. And so he sits on her knee. 
And I didn't get to record it because he was kind of turned. And if I had pulled the camera out, he would have saw me. And then I don't know what would have happened. They're like they, you could tell they were different kind of people. And so I don't know what they would have done if they thought that I was filming them. And so I didn't get too much of them when they didn't know I was filming them. But it was hilarious. I just laughed and laughed. And you've got to you've got to watch it again because this woman. I just wish I could have gotten a full shot. From now on, when I do these, I'm going to try to get the full shot or no shot at all because you either get the full story or it's really nothing and so I'm sorry for these first few clips where you didn't get to see too much of anything hilarious but it was great and I just needed to share that with you Okay, so I, there I showed you two different clips. Sorry, the shadow's in my face. I showed you two different clips at once, and that's down by the city center area. And if you noticed the police car, you need to keep your eyes on that because there's a distinct reason why I included it that time. Uh, and you'll find out in the next few clips. There were... Uh, <clears throat> That, that's where a lot of people wait for the train and then there was a terrible smell during that first clip I turned it on because they're doing construction they're building some big building and it smelled terrible 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 it smelled like and I don't mean the just like it smells like crap here I mean the real stuff it was bad and I was like, oh man, and then I just, I walked past a few people, I think it was those people. There are so many people in Salt Lake that just need to take a shower. It was disgusting. You'll find that in any big city though, especially New York. I think that's one of the dirtiest cities in the world. But okay, moving on.